Hey there everyone, today's video is going to be a shoe unboxing video and the shoes that I'm going to be unboxing for you guys today are another pair of Demonias. Now the box does look a little bit dusty but that's because I was sanding down a cabinet over here and repainting it. So the shoes that I'm going to be unboxing for you guys today are the Demonia Boxer 05s and if you follow me on Instagram you've already seen these. Um, I bought these from Tragic Beautiful as a special order item and you can special order whatever Demonias or Pleasers that you want from both Tragic Beautiful and Berserk. You just send them an email and they'll get them in for you. Uh, this style is very, very hard to come across because most websites stocked the higher topped version which was the Boxer 06 I think. Personally, I don't like sneakers with the slightly high top because it tends to make my legs look very, very short and I'm already a short person. I want to look as tall as possible. This shoe features a 4 inch raised platform made of mixed rubber and foam and it's very lightweight, surprisingly. You'd think these would be really, really heavy. It also has a rolled front for comfort of movement, which if you have platforms that don't have this, you will understand how imperative it is for platforms to have this for movement and comfortability of the movement. The shoes look like futuristic sport shoe kind of things, which is what I love about them. This shoe also features two Velcro straps for ease of getting in and out, um, but the straps don't like to tighten that much. The thing I have seen about the higher topped ones is they have a bit more range of movement so you can get a more form-fitting shoe. These ones don't really do that. Also, if you are vegan, these are perfectly okay for you. They, most ammonias are made of polyurethane or PU, which is fake leather. The comfortability of these shoes is pretty much second to none when it comes to four inch platforms. Um, my most comfortable shoes that I own are my Winkle Pickers and my New Rocks. My New Rocks being number one. Um, these are in the top five of all my shoes. And if you've been here for a while, I own a lot of shoes. I'm a shoe addict. There are two things that I am not so keen on with these shoes, but I put up with it, is one, this bulky base. It really helps with um, stability, but when you're walking and you've been wearing, say I've been wearing my Winkle Pickers for a week and then I go to wear these, I will trip over myself because I'm not used to the wide bottom. Two is a problem that I think is kind of isolated for my ankles. I have a large piece of bone that sticks out of one of my ankles. I have broken both my ankles and this was a callus kind of thing that formed around one of my ankle pins. And it rubs right on here and there's nothing I can do about it. I have to wear a thick padding within the shoe, like on my skin, um, to stop this from hurting and blistering. But I think that would just be isolated for me, but also my ankle bones sit just on this so it does get a little bit annoying at times i generally wear these with ankle socks so i will have a little something pop out the top um i know people don't like that look but i really don't care i'm a little bit more for comfort these days one thing i am absolutely smitten with these shoes besides the look is how natural my foot feels within them um, if you've ever looked at your foot, it naturally kind of sits down a little bit and then your toes slope up and this is exactly what this does. So it allows for hours and hours of comfortable wear. I know because I have worn these for 10 hours straight now. I was walking around Ikea all day trying to pick a new cabinet, didn't end up finding anything there, went to another furniture store and yeah, 10 hours of walking around and no, no problems. The only problems I had, as I said, was my ankle bone. When it comes to sizing, these shoes are in men's sizes. Demonia is very split with how they size the shoes. They're either in women's or men's, and a lot of the popular styles are in men's. I bought myself a size six men's. For reference, lately I have been a size eight US in Demonia because their size chart changed. I'm generally a Euro 37 and a half to 38, so the new sizing charts dictate that that is a women's size 8. So the general rule of thumb to find your men's size is subtract 2 from your women's size. That means I'm a size 6. They fit very very well around here but then they really widen in the arch area towards the toe bed and um, that does get a little bit annoying because I do have a narrow foot but I have put an insert down here to stop my foot from sliding around a lot because it was sliding from side to side and that's just not cool. I'm very happy with my sizing choice. I, I'm glad I went with a size six instead of a size five men's 
If I went with a size 5, I probably could have fit in it, um, and it would have fit better around the toe bed, but I think it would have been a bit tight around the heel. As I said in my last shoe unboxing video, find your Euro size. I've never had a problem with my Euro size. In fact, uh, it's all been smooth sailing with my Euro sizing. So you can see the shoes in more detail and you can get an idea of what they look like on human legs. I will cut to a clip of me wearing them right now. So overall, I'm very, very happy with these shoes. There's nothing to really disappoint me besides the fact it hurts my ankles a little bit to wear them. And it's not really fun having to put on band-aids, but it's just, I've got a funny shaped foot. I have a feeling that these shoes will get a lot of wear to them. One, because they're not really that heeled. Two, because they look awesome. And three, because they're casual and we're not all dressing up. 24 7 so casual shoes are a real must. If you're looking for something that's casual, that's different from what everyone else has and futuristic then I would really highly recommend these. Another thing is that these look fantastic leg warmers. I know leg warmers aren't for everyone and they certainly aren't really for me. I will wear them with two pairs of shoes now. My Demonia Carers and now these. So I hope you enjoyed this shoe unboxing video. Um, I've probably got another one coming soon. I actually probably more than one. It's my birthday soon and people buy me shoes and vouchers which I end up spending on shoes. I just, I love shoes. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already because I'd love to be here for every single video. Like this video if you like the shoes. Comment down below if there's something you would like to see on this channel. Also, what are your thoughts on these shoes? And hope you all have a fantabulous day.